On my way back on the uh, Tokyo, Tokyo Metro to our hotel, and I'm listening to the Japan Abroad uh, podcast, which is a good one. Uh, also, subscribe to the Abroad in Japan YouTube channel, which is also a good one. And I was listening to the podcast episode is Japan ranked worst country in the world for helping strangers. I'm thinking, what? There was an actual survey with this? What in the hell are these guys talking about? So I Googled it, and uh, I found this article in Japan today. You see this here? Japan ranked worst country in the world for helping strangers. What? I'm looking at this thing. It says that this is a Charities Aid Foundation World Giving Index survey. 142 countries they surveyed. Japan was dead last in the world for helping strangers. Only 22% of Japanese said they helped a uh, stranger in the last month. That does not square with the last month I've had traveling around Japan. So many people helped us, and I've filmed some of those, so I'm gonna show you that right now. I don't know, maybe the Japanese are just very modest or humble. Oh no, I didn't help anyone when they really did. Or is it just that they're very shy? I don't know what it is, but the Japanese, the idea that the Japanese are the least helpful people in the world is insane and I've traveled to more than 80 countries. I think this is country 81 for me. I would say they are some of the most helpful people of any country in the world. So let's take a look at some of the experiences I've had. I've only filmed a few of them, a small fraction of the people who have helped me. Uh, most of the time I haven't been filming, but a few times I have. So let's take a look and you be the judge whether the Japanese are the least helpful people in the world. I sure as hell don't think that they are. One thing I love about Japan, oftentimes when you ask somebody directions, rather than just point you, they actually take you there. I asked her where to find a drink. She could have just pointed in a direction. Instead, she's going to take me. She's going to take me right there. Well, the thing I'm wondering about is, is his seat real? Is it a legitimate ticket? It's a good one? Would you like, Would you like to buy it for 6,000 yen? Uh, what I'm wondering is, is it a real ticket? Is it real? Uh, uh, <laughs> what, what was that? Price down, free. Uh, what did he say? One thousand. He made it one thousand yen cheaper. Yeah. Great. Yeah. <laughs> Arigato gozaimasu. Okay. All right. All right. So I got a ticket. 5,000 yen, I think it's about $30. Who knows, let's find out. And as always, I'm lost in Shinjuku station. Thank God I found these ladies to help me who are leading me out of the station because I think I spent 20 minutes just wandering around Shinjuku station. No idea where I'm going. So confusing. Really, this was like 20 minutes of walking around in Shinjuku station and I think I would die in the station if I did not find somebody to help me to get out of here because it's like you're it's the world's largest train station and it's kind of like you're in a you're stuck in a prison you can't get out of it I literally could not find any exit and thankfully these ladies are leading me out of here to show me where to go uh, I feel sorry for my wife because she's supposed to meet me here there's no way she's gonna find it unless she finds somebody to help her Okay, trying more conveyor belt sushi tonight for my, for my YouTube channel. So they're helping me, thank God I have some friends here who are helping. How do you pronounce the name of this sushi place? What's the name of this restaurant? Uh, Uobe. 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 Yeah. So here we got a little shrimp with cheese, and then we have some yellowtail, some draft beer. And you, what are you having? Salmon. Salmon. <laughs> and you're having cucumber, right? Is it good? All right. Hello. 
So, all right, so tell us something about Odaiba. You've been here many times before. Where should we go? What do you like about Odaiba? I like uh, ocean view and then um, also, um, also, uh, what should I say? Sorry. Um, also, I, I know there's a terrace, uh, you can mm -hmm. see the ocean, and um, it's in the Taiko Museum, Taiko mm -hmm. Kokugikan. Okay. Taiko Kokugikan. And what was your name again? Yoshimiya. Yoshimiya. Is that your first name or last name? Uh, my last name. My first name, yeah. That's your first name. And so what I'm so impressed about is you're multitasking. I mean, I just want everybody on my video to see this. So you've got the, she's not only chat, she's live streaming with this camera right here. Then she's chatting with her followers here. Yes. And then this phone you're using maps. for your directions, for your maps. Yeah, maps. You need an assistant. Assistant, yeah. All right, I don't want your viewers to get bored talking with us anymore, so uh, we'll let you go. Yeah. But it was nice to meet you. Thank nice you so much. Arigato gozaimasu. Arigato Bye. It is a beautiful Sunday afternoon. We are walking in Omote Sando, which is one of the most famous boulevards in Tokyo. It's known for upscale shopping. Every kind of expensive uh, shop you can imagine is here. We are very, very lucky today because we have Mr. Mitsuo Hattori, yeah. who's here with us. He is a volunteer guide. <laughs> And uh, I'll tell you something very unique about Japan is that every city or most major cities in Japan have these organizations where there are volunteers who will uh, take you around. Yes. And for a very small amount of money, basically you're covering their lunch and their transportation and a small fee, they will take you around and you get to meet a local person and to learn from them. And uh, if you come to Japan, yeah. it's something that you definitely should do. So this is Mishiko, I our guide. <laughs> the best I'm fanning her because guide. it's very hot. This is the best <laughs> local guide in Kanazawa. Yes, because I've lived here for over 70 years. No way. No way. <laughs> Impossible. But I'm going to put your contact information in my video. So <laughs> will people be able to, can I give your email address out? Yes. Okay. okay. Perfect. Perfect. What are we going to see today? Yeah. Where are we going? Kanazawa, Kanazawa Castle. Castle. We're going to Kanazawa Castle. And after that, we will enjoy Samurai District. Samurai. Uh -huh. And after that, Ninja, Ninja right? Uh, we we had you have you had a reservation for Ninja Dera, yes. you know? So I, I I'll take you there. I'm mm -hmm. fanning Michiko because it's very hot here today. Yeah. All right. Thank you. Very kind of We're gonna you. We're going to have. Are we going to have? Yes, thank you. That's so Yayoi is saying that um, that there is one trail, Jen, that it's it's four kilometers long. If you want to take the long trail here. This is a couple hours. Two hours. Yeah, otherwise it's a four kilometer trail or you can take a short trail. But I I prepared this without permission, so don't do that. Okay. <laughs> I don't do okay, okay, yeah, but that's the okay. to go. When's the last time you got a huge smile with your coffee at Starbucks by the person delivering it to you? Arigato gozaimasu. Ocean. I'm gonna ask these kids. Sumimasen, do you know Fuku Choshin line to Shinjuku? Is that the right way though? That says something else. Do you think that's the right way? This says Shinjuku Station. It doesn't say what platform. Sometimes it tells you what platform, but it doesn't say what platform here. It doesn't say what platform. You think it's this way? This way? Yes, yes. Okay. Arigato. <laughs> Oh, 
Must be further this way, huh? Even for people who live here, it's very confusing. Now it's not even, the signs aren't even talking about Fukutosha anymore. Fukutosha, where did you go? Wait a minute, there's another Fukutosha. This one? This Fukutosha? Fukutoshin? Fukutoshin. This one? Arigato gozaimasu. Bye. Arigato. Bye. Boom, they got me here. So you find some nice friendly school kids. There it is. This is the right Fukutoshi. All right. Yeah, there's just one more thing I want to tell her. Can I speak it into your phone? Yeah. And then I want... You are my favorite person in Koyasan. <laughs> now, well, let's ask her, are we her favorite people no. in Koyasan? No, no, <laughs> are we her no. favorite customers in Koyasan? Yes, favorite, favorite, favorite customers. <laughs> favorite customers today. <laughs> uh, favorite customers in the last 10 minutes? Yeah. No, you don't have to ask her. Okay. How am I going to get, I'm going to get back across this sea of people now again? Construction. I don't think I'm ever going to find this Odaki line. They're going to find my body here in this train station. And, uh, I should leave a note saying I was just looking for the Odaki line. Oh, God. See, this says Odaki, but it's talking about the Odaki department store. What in the hell? Odaki, it says right here. But this is like a de freaking department store? So confused. How the fuck do we get there? So, Mimasan, is this Odaku train or Odaku department store? Uh, department. Department. Where is the Odaku train line? Do you know? Okay. Uh, follow me. Okay. Arigato. Gosh, I think I found somebody who knows where they're going. Holy cow. found somebody who knows where they're going. Odaki line. Okay, arigato, arigato gozaimasu. Okay. This nice gentleman about the buses and like most people in Japan, he's trying to figure everything out for me. So blue, blue bus, Omiya Street. Okay. 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 Arigato gozaimasu. My God, that food was so good. I just plowed through this meal. A pretty decent sized meal too, donburi, which is rice, uh, egg, and beef, which was delicious, and these, and these soba noodles, and some little pickled stuff. In about a minute and a half, it was so incredibly good. This place is unbelievable. I'm making a little video. Can you can, sit, tell me the name of this restaurant again for everybody who sees it? My uh, name? The name of the restaurant. Sorry. Uh, and also your name too, sure. Shoraku is shoraku. Shoraku? Shoraku. Shoraku. Homemade udon and soba. Made fresh here every day. Yes. 
Yes. Last order is at 645. Uh, yes. Exactly. And what was your name? My name is Katsue. Katsue. Yes. Katsue speaks very good English, and she couldn't be nicer. This is the place to eat in Kyoto, for sure. And how much did this cost? How much does this meal cost? 1,030. 1,000 and how much? 1,030. So that's, that is like seven, seven U.S. dollars for a delicious meal. Thank you. Arigato gozaimasu. exciting, but I'm so nervous when I'm speaking. No, don't be nervous. You speak beautifully. I need to practice. This is a fantastic place. You need to practice? Yeah? Okay, everybody come here. What time do you... Bye. Bye. Thank you so much. Thank you Bye -bye. so much. Sure, my pleasure. Bye-bye. Thank you. This woman could not be nicer. She's literally coming outside and thanking me for eating there. This is my friend from the <laughs> restaurant. What is your name? Ariadne. <laughs> Very nice guy. We just had.